Morning everybody, Vape Crusader here with another electronic cigarette review. Uh, this time I'm going to be looking at this guy. This is the new screwdriver keyring from eSigScrewdriver.com and uh, there are other online retail outlets for it as well. Um, it comes in a kind of uh, blister pack here with um, you know that kind of hard plastic cover on but uh, actually that's not a problem you just flip it off the back it's really easy so there was none of that hacking about with uh, with kitchen knives and so on that uh, I'm sure we're all familiar with. Um, it also comes with two uh, cartomizers um, which I've tried and they're fine um, they're vanilla flavor and uh, sorry they're um, tobacco flavor and I don't particularly like that so uh, as it's a kind of standard uh, 510 fitting I've just whacked in a, a rock um, 16 milligram vanilla which is one of my favorites um, okay so that's that uh, oh it also comes I should say with um, a nice little sort of USB charger that uh, actually feels pretty pretty tonk um, seems well made uh, and in fact you know the whole product comes with a really good sort of feeling of, of quality so that's uh, that's that's all very good now as I say the main thing about this is the size I mean have a look at that it's very very small you can see it there on my hand and I'll put it up now next to there we are that is a Libro Realis which I thought was really the smallest e-cig on the market this is actually I would say two or three millimeters shorter than that which uh, which is really very good um, there's a, a jack um, with the shorter of their two batteries on there so it's a fair bit shorter than that as well so that just gives it some kind of um, context there or frame of reference um, what it does have of course though is is quite a bit more sort of diameter than than these other guys that's the Libero again uh, and of course the reason for that is that the battery is um, is a lot more powerful I mean normally you find with these mini sigs that uh, you know the battery lasts an hour or two and then you're having to recharge it and so on uh, and that's not a massive problem because you know you've normally got a portable charging case and you've got another battery charging and you just swap them over so that's that's fine but you know this is quite uh, this is quite good because if you just want to sort of go and not have to sort of think about portable charging cases and so on it's great and it relieves you of the uh, of the problem of thinking too much about uh, about charging so it's a, it's a very powerful little battery I think it's 350 uh, milliamp hours um, and I I reckon as a as a sort of former 30 a day smoker uh, I probably need seven or eight hundred milliamp hours to get me through the day um, this gets me through half a day with without any problem at all There's the vape. I mean, you know, there's there's plenty of vape production there. A nice sort of stroke throat, stroke throat. Do I mean that? I mean throat stroke. Um, yeah. So it's it's just a very sort of uh, satisfying product, and um, you know, I wouldn't uh, I wouldn't hesitate to give this a a nine out of ten product rating. It's really well made. It's transportable. Um, it's, it's light enough and small enough to be transportable but uh, at the same time kind of heavy enough to give you a really sort of good feeling of, of quality. It's got this kind of little lanyard thing on there which you know you can attach to your keyring I suppose you know um, I wouldn't because I don't like things dangling around on my keyring but you know I guess that's up to you. So yeah nine, 9 out of 10 uh, for this product really very good um, and I think as well it's worth saying that uh, you know if you're if you're new to the world of vaping, um, this would be a really good kind of entry level product uh, for you. Uh, as far as the guys at uh, e6screwdriver.com are concerned, they seem to be uh, you know a nice friendly bunch of guys. Uh, they're efficient. You know, I, I asked for the product on day one and got it on day two, so they would get from me a company rating of uh, of eight out of ten. I don't know them that well yet, but uh, that may well improve as as I do. So all in all, a good company, a great product, um, go out and buy one. Thanks very much.